Assalamu alaikum my name is Muhammad Shamasi and you are watching my YouTube channel in this video we will see that how we can simulate a mixer and a splitter in Aspen Hisis so let's start and first of all we see that what we are having our problem so uh, this is our problem in which we are having two streams and their uh, molar flow rates have been given to us and we have to find the composition and the molar uh, flow rate of the product stream so we are having two streams that will be mixed to get the third stream that will be our product stream so we are having two components that are ethanol and water so we will move to our simulation environment in this we will first add our components that are ethanol and water and water uh, After adding my both components, I will move to the fluid package and uh, fluid package uh, I will use here will be NRTL. So I am using NRTL. After this, I will, there are no reactions as it is uh, physical operation and unit operation uh, mixing. So I will next move to the simulation environment directly. After moving uh, to the simulation environment, I can see that uh, the first thing that is present in model palette is mixer. So I will drag it on and after this I can uh, double click on it. So now I have to give the stream. So uh, I will name my stream as 1 and 2. So that are the uh, reactant streams. So I am uh, going to have only one stream product stream. So I am naming it as 3. After pressing enter, it says that not solved because uh, I have not given the temperature pressure. So the temperature that was given to us uh, was 25 degree and 5 atm was pressure. So uh, temperature was 25 degrees and 5 atm was the pressure. So I will write as 5 atm. So now the molar flow rate was 100 kg and uh, now I will define the, uh, the molar flow. So I will select here as mole flow and uh, in the mole flow I will again go to the problem and it says that 20 uh, kg mole of uh, ethanol. So the remaining will be water. So 20 kg mole of ethanol and 80 kg mole will be our water so now uh, i will select uh, ok so after this i will go to my stream 2 it uh, was having temperature again 25 and my uh, pressure was again 5 atm and my the molar flow was again 100 kg mole and when I will specify the mole uh, ratios, so that was 40 kg mole of ethanol. So 40 kg mole of ethanol and remaining 60 will be what? After select uh, pressing, after pressing OK, you can see that a green uh, color has been popped out. My problem has been solved i can go to the properties to find all the properties and i can go to the composition and in the composition i can find that uh, i am having and uh, my, my product stream is having 0.7 percent of uh, water and 0.3 percent of ethanol and you can go to design sorry worksheet and conditions here you can find the uh, uh, molar flow rate that you are having and that is the mass flow rate so uh, if you want to see that uh, it is uh, correct or wrong so you can see that that are our uh, ratio 0.3 percent of ethanol and that is water and i can uh, show you that what was the mass flow rate so that was 200 kg so in this uh, way you can see that how we can simulate a mixer in Aspen Hisis. So in the same video I am going to show you that how we can simulate a splitter. Now we will see that how we can add a splitter or use a splitter in Aspen Hisis or simulate a splitter in Aspen Hisis. So the second 
thing that is uh, that is present in model palette that is a splitter so i will drag it onto my main screen that is a uh, t or you can say that it is a splitter a splitter is a reverse of mixer it will have one feed stream and it can uh, divide this feed stream into how, uh, the number of streams that you want to uh, divide it into so now uh, i required a feed stream uh, i can add this three as a feed stream to this splitter and or i can uh, use a another stream or define an another stream so the inlet stream for my splitter i am going to say that it is three i can uh, define a new stream as well now uh, i want my outlet stream so i want my this uh, three in the, uh, stream that was the product stream of a mixer to split into again into uh, you can say that uh, two parts so i will name is uh, i will name it as 4 and 5 so you can see that see that uh, as one is is already uh, simulating or uh, defining two stream define two streams as 4 and 5 so as I go to my worksheet, you can see that uh, as uh, it was uh, my it, it was the product stream of the uh, mixer. So my temperature, uh, pressure, and flow rates had had already been defined. So now I will go to the parameters, and here I will uh, have to specify the flow ratios, and that uh, how what what percent of my flow goes to uh, this four, and what percent of my uh, uh, flow goes to the 5 so I will divide it as 0 uh, 0.23 percent in 4 and the rest it will calculate auto automatically so 0 0.7 percent will go into the 5 uh, stream 5 so if I drag it onto so you can see that my uh, question this question has already been solved uh, a green color has been popped up I will go to the worksheet and you will see that uh, that are the uh, flow rates uh, of the, uh, stream 4 and 5 and if you want to see the composition go to the properties or oh, sorry compositions and here you will see that composition will not change and only the uh, flow rates will change when you uh, split a stream into uh, two or three parts so in this way in this video i had uh, shown you that how we can simulate a mixer and a splitter in aspen i hope you like the video inshallah meet you in another video assalamu alaikum